everyone. Welcome to Africa Underground Basketball Blog. A few days before the FIBA AfroBasket 2021 qualifiers, both in Kigali, Rwanda and uh, Cairo in Egypt, we received today Ariel Bokal, who are from Kenya National Basketball Team, who accept to answer to our questions. Just listing what you have to tell to us after the break. Please. Hello, uh, my name is Ariel Okal, Kenyan professional uh, basketball player. I play uh, in Algeria for a team called Union uh, Sportive in a city called Satif. I'm also a member of uh, the Kenyan national basketball team, uh, which is called the Morans. Uh, the reason I started playing basketball is, uh, first of all, basketball is a cool sport and basketball uh, I use it as a teacher uh, of life. The game has taught me a lot of things, the game has taught me how to be competitive in life uh, in general and the game has also taught me how to be a team player. The game of basketball has also taught me um, humility and uh, a lot of things, how to associate with my friends, how to follow instructions and so many other things. I can also say that the game of basketball chose me and uh, it has been an amazing journey for me ever since I started playing the game of basketball. Uh, on my state of mind uh, before the competition, uh, I'm trying to stay as calm as possible and I'm also um, trying to focus on the task ahead. I know it's going; it's not going to be easy because uh, Senegal, uh, Mozambique and uh, 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 Angola are really pretty good teams and uh, they've been there in the continent playing big basketball in the biggest stage of uh, basketball in Africa and I have so much respect for them. Um, but that doesn't mean that I should be scared of them. I respect them, but uh, as an individual, I'm not scared uh, of competing against uh, 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 these teams. Uh, so I'm focused, and also uh, my teammates are focused. Uh, they're preparing well uh, uh, to face uh, the task ahead. Uh, the mood in camp is really good, and uh, everybody right now is focused on one goal, one goal only, and that is uh, um, winning uh, the games that are going to be uh, the games that are, are ahead of us in the upcoming Afro Basket qualifying uh, tournament in uh, Kigali, Rwanda. The next step in my career right now will be uh, winning uh, the Afro Basket uh, Championship because that will mean that. Uh, uh, I'm gonna go down in history as one of the few people who have really uh, played in a team that has actually uh, won it. And uh, in my uh, professional career also, uh, I really wanna retire in Europe and probably win a championship uh, in whichever country uh, that I'm gonna play in, uh, in the future. Uh, on the big three in, uh, in Africa, uh, uh, in countries, I would say Tunisia. Tunisia, they have uh, good basketball. And uh, Nigeria will be uh, my second choice, my second pick. And the third one is Angola. Uh, because Angola, uh, uh, they have had a really good uh, winning culture uh, over the years. <laughs> Um, big three players are out of Africa, uh, I'll still say, uh, I can say uh, uh, Hakim Olajuwon. Hakim Olajuwon is solid and he's also, I can say he's also uh, the greatest of all time, you know, coming out of Africa. Uh, Dikembe Mutombo uh, comes in second and Kikas Gomez of Angola was also a solid player. I can add a few more names, but those three are people that I actually kind of watched when I was studying how to play uh, the game of basketball. Uh, the best player of all time, the GOAT, greatest of all time in Africa, 
Hakeem Olajuwon, although he didn't uh, uh, suit up uh, Nigerian uh, for the Nigerian national team, but still is uh, from Africa. And the greatest of all time overall, you know, in the world, LeBron James. LeBron James is the greatest of all time, no doubt about that. Things he have done on and uh, off the basketball court are really inspirational. And as a basketball player who looks up to him, I have no doubt and uh, I really believe that LeBron James is the greatest basketballer to ever dribble a basketball. I'd love to shout out my teammates in the Kenya Morans, the Kenya national basketball team, my teammates in Algeria, uh, US Sativ. I, I will also uh, shout out my teammates, my former teammates in uh, Ali, Sidab, Oman, and Dofar, Basketball, Salala, Oman, my teammates in uh, Tanzania, Don Bosco, Savio, Don Bosco, Panthers in the Doma too. Uh, these are my, the guys that have uh, uh, made me who I am today. My college mates, uh, the guys that I played with when I was younger, Sam Parkins, Migiro, Andre Zadok, Anthony, uh, Churchill, these are my college mates, and my childhood friends back in uh, my hometown, Nakuru, uh, Kenya Military Academy, Shamak, Kayus, Charlo, uh, Sheikh, and all those uh, people that I played with in uh, the division basketball in Kenya. Shout out to you all, Koji, George and the whole Nakuru Club basketball team, Kenya Ports Authority basketball team. Peace out. Thank you for following us and stay connected to our social media accounts on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube channel. Don't forget to share and like our YouTube page. Thank you and stay tuned.